An F1 in school's car is put under so much stress, especially at the end of the track. So you have to make sure that you test the different types of stresses that the car is under. So if there's a stress force getting pushed into the car, we can put it into a virtual testing and make sure that it's strong enough so that this much force going into the front doesn't break the car. Your car braking will cost you points and that's not a fun thing. The computer can simulate going at a speed and it shows shear stress. So say your wings are made 0.2 of a millimetre thick, it could show that the air going at 20 metres per second would shear them off. It was important to virtually analyse many different designs and how does air flow around them, what is their drag coefficient. Drag is important when you're testing, drag is important when you're racing, drag is important at all points throughout this competition and it really changes the game. Primarily we use CFD just to get the numbers on the drag. As it gets lower your car gets faster. And that really allows us to optimize the car to a pinpoint. The CFD programs show you where the air sticks to the car and using this you are able to adjust the CAD program so that it allows the air to leave the car so it can move forward without resistance. CFD gives you a qualitative data. It lets you see what's going on and gives you areas where you can improve the car.